Now I know some of you have already seen it in some of my recent videos, but today I wanted to finally talk about the recent upgrade I did to my home studio. These LED front lit and back lit custom acoustic panels from Psy Acoustic. But before we show you the acoustic treatment, quick word from our sponsor, Direct Music Service. DMS is an online database where DJs can get their music from. There's thousands of unique edits, remixes, and originals that you can choose from of your favorite tracks that you can use to rock your next dance floor. They also have an app that you can use on your mobile device where you can browse their database and then save songs so that it appears on your Dropbox when you get home. I'm gonna leave you two discount links down below in the pinned comment if you want to subscribe. Go to directmusicservice.com today to sign up. All right, just got my packages from Psy Acoustics. We're gonna be unboxing them. So before I even found out about the company Psy Acoustics, I've already seen their work on Instagram from other producers' home studios. What makes them unique is not just the fact that they provide an acoustic panel with the option to front light and back light the panel with LEDs, but also the fact that they print artwork on the acoustic panel. You can either provide your own or choose from an array of visual artists. In my initial purchase, I provided the artwork myself. Two of the photos are actually ones I've taken with the Pioneer DJ gear I have and the other two pieces of artwork was from stock rendered images of Pioneer DJ gear, the CDJ3000 and the DJM S11 SE. In this first purchase, I actually only got the backlight LEDs. The panels are made with a wood frame and the acoustic material is actually mineral wool. The artwork on the fabric looks really well done. The colors are very vibrant and look really good under the light and they are mounted onto the frame really, really well. The lines don't look crooked on the artwork and the folding on the edges looks nice and neat. Since I'm not a handy person, I called upon the help of my friend Arthur to help me mount the panels up. But after watching them, I quickly realized how easy it is to actually put them up on the wall. Using a drill, a leveler, and a tape measure, I was able to follow what Arthur showed me to put up a panel myself. Each one of the panels run on an LED controller, which you can control on an app on your phone. But we quickly soon realized that the backlight alone made it difficult to see the artwork in the front. So along with an additional 3x3 panel with my logo on it, decided to add the front LED lights to all the 2x4 panels. They're just as easy to install as the wedge mounts that mounts the panels to the walls. And the electronics easily integrate with the existing power supply used for the backlight. But because they're on a separate controller, you can sync them independently from the backlight. A really cool setting you can do on the controller app is to actually put the front light and the back light on music control. I put the backlight LEDs on jump and the front lights on strobe, which gives it this party club feel. But my favorite setting is the one I call Star Destroyer, where I put the backlight in teal and the front lights in red. So it looks like the bridge of a Star Destroyer. The mineral wool is way more absorbent than the wedge foam panels I had up previously. It was a big sonic difference as well. So yeah, these are my new panels from Psy Acoustics. If you wanna see what my home studio looked like when I first built it, check out this playlist right here. All right, see you in the next video.